So clap for us, babe. Clap. Like a slate? Oh, Thank yeah. Blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. So, you, uh, you two are engaged. Um, do you have a sister, though? But, like, what does the K in Kmart really stand for? I don't know, it's like, food is just too expensive, so, like, why don't we just eat her? I like her hair. Thanks. I'm Mike, somebody hard to forks. Ooh, and I'm Summer. No salmon for me, please. <laughs> Who are those guys? <laughs> and that's you guys? <laughs> Do me. I'm a fan of psychological torture. It doesn't leave any evidence. Well, we could be done with this already, but someone doesn't want to stone them in the streets. That's inhumane. What is so inhumane about crucifixion? It's simple. We kill the Batman. Or, well, in this case, Mike and Summer, because, yeah. I want to kill Mike and Summer just as much as the rest of you, but I'm afraid something even more evil will spawn from them. And I kind of feel sorry for the maggots. What should we do? I really don't care. I just got an appointment at three. Oh, come on, guys. You know, we should be there to support them and be loving good friends. Shut, Shut up, Gene! Okay, so I guess we're going to go kill Peter and Amy? No! Oh my god, no! Mike and Summer! Guys, why do we break off in huddles all the time? It's weird and kind of claustrophobic. All I'm saying is that Inuits shouldn't be allowed to rent cars. Wow, you're a racist. I thought the Jimmy Fallon cameo on Cop Rock was kind of shoehorned. Mm, I mean, you gotta get the ratings these days. Yeah, but... Can know. we focus on the issue at hand? Who's Jimmy Fallon? Give me just a second, ma'am. I'm looking at our files, and it looks like I don't give a shit. Well, can we get some goddamn help over here? I am up to my balls in sick toads. Well, I think the main problem here is that your dog is old as shit. Well, ma'am, your dog isn't sick. He's just fucking racist. Uh, what kind of animal is it? Where the fuck did you get a gorilla? What the fuck is a Pyrenees? Yeah, you know, I, I think it really all just dates back to my father. Can you hold on for a second? I was just talking to the smartest dog. Come get in my flying car. We need to kill the fuck out of Mike and Summer. I need you two to get back together. My Tumblr doomed to you fan page is in ruins right now. No one's reblogged me. Yes, Mike and Summer deserve to die. And I hope they burn in hell. I have had it up to here with this motherfucking Mike and Summer in this motherfucking cinematic universe. I know you've both seen me in The Hateful Eight, but I want to talk to you about The Hateful Two, a four hour long movie where you both kill Mike and Summer. Also, I'm involved, so it's Hateful Three. Also, I think this would have been a lot more powerful if I just said, I need to talk to you both. Uh, I don't know. I'm sorry. Will you enjoy my thing or not? What did you think of me in Lakeview Terrace? What if I told you there was another New Testament of Jesus Christ as told to by a great man here in America. I have a new favorite Bible verse. It's from the book of Let's Fucking Kill Mike and Summer. The verse is Now. Let's. Why was Mike's arm in a bandage for exactly one scene? Why was Mike's sister at the trial? Was she there to support her brother or did she also think Mike and Summer should break up? What's with everybody in this show's hair in the first two episodes? How long was this day? Make sure to like and subscribe Puffin Publishing Podcast on iTunes. If you enjoyed this show, please check out both Get Your Man and Pet Turtles. Okay, I'm done. Uh, cut! <laughs>